Well, as most of you know, and if you didn't know, I am affiliated with F11 products. So uh, these videos I'm putting on here are showing what's happening in different stages. Uh, the first video I put on here was showing you how uh, to apply it, how to prepare the truck and get it ready to go. And then uh, the next one is showing this and that and this. Well, this one is about six weeks after I put the stuff on there. And this is the way it looks. Well, I lost the video that I had saved for this part. I put a coat on here and I put a coat down right here. I didn't put it underneath here. It don't get any sunlight under there naturally. So we, uh, anyway, that's what we got done going on this part. I didn't do the whole thing. Too doggone expensive to do the whole thing. But uh, I wanted to get this part done and see how it works. It's pretty shiny there, as you can see right here. And it was was not shiny at all. You can still see, you can see some reflection there, I think. But it was dull, real dull. Well, it rained all night, off and on anyway, enough to leave <laughs> the water on the truck. Now, so I don't know, it's dirty under there. And they said if it's dirty, it won't run off. Well, I don't know, what's the point of that? So, what I'm gonna do is we're gonna wash it and then uh, see if it, uh, cause it's, it's like, geez, I haven't washed this thing in, two or three weeks now. So it's got a lot of dust sitting on it. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a towel and I'm just gonna dry this part off and uh, that'll clean it off. And then if it rains again tonight, which it's supposed to, we'll see if it, what it does. You can see it beat it up. You can see that, hopefully. And let me, uh, I'm gonna get that off there because I just smeared it all over. We'll get that off of there and then we'll uh, check it out next time. Uh oh, here comes the wife. Well, she's got the truck running, so I'm going to talk loud. I don't know if you can see this or not, but when I wiped this with a towel, it left swirl marks. I'm going to leave it that way and see what it looks like when it dries. Uh, it's still wet. Maybe I'll get a fiber towel and go over it. Maybe the towel was just too wet. It got wet. I'm pretty wet. Let's uh, run a, a uh, fiber towel over it. I did not do the roof or the side, just the hood, so we can see what that looks like. I think I'm gonna take half the hood and take a fiber towel, and do this half, and leave the other that way. We'll see what it looks like once it dries. Well, this side was with the fiber towel. This was without, I left one spot, right there, where the water droplets ran off the top once we was driving, it came down on it. Uh, other than that, I mean, it's good and shiny. And not just wiping it off, didn't wash it, just dried off the rainwater. Let's see what it looks like up on top, because I didn't dry nothing. I didn't dry nothing up here. No spots. I can't see a spot anywhere. You can't see what I'm looking at in the camera because it's for a right out. That looks clean. And I didn't do nothing to it. I let the water rain do it. I'm gonna take it down and do a car wash on it real soon. Like I said, it's been sitting here for quite some time without any washing at all. Just to rain. And then I took that rag and wiped the thing down one time. You've seen that in the other video. Or earlier in this video, I don't know where this will go. But so far, still looking pretty good. It's definitely dusty under there. It's shining on a good angle today. Look at how that's beaded up. Now, I think that's a good thing. I don't know. I'm not, and I didn't yesterday either. I'm not going to wipe this off. I'm going to let it dry on there and see what it looks like. That's from uh, the rain, or dew, dew. Might have rained, I don't know. It is winter here. It's uh, supposed to only get up to 
58 I think today and then it gets wet at night so I'm gonna stick this on here with the other little videos I've been taking let's see what it looks like after she dries well can you guys see the spots on here I'm gonna move this around the Sun's hitting it pretty good okay now this truck it's it's, it's dirty and hasn't been waxed in a year Is that right okay so that's nothing on it same rainstorm yesterday sorry about the wiggle guys because I don't want to cut this off and then start up again but that's Terry's truck and now I didn't dry this you have seen the last little video clip it had them little spots all over it I don't see a spot anywhere got some water marks on the chrome here but I didn't do the chrome so okay I'm showing you what it really is I'm not taking a bucket of mud and throwing it on my truck or nothing this is the actual way it's working uh, like I said I think I still need more another coat on there it's shinier than it was but it ain't glossy shine shiny but there's no spots on it either even with one coat and that was covered in water now there's your update I'll throw the, I'm gonna throw some of these on once I get about 10 10 minutes worth I'll throw them on I don't know let you guys see what we see what we're coming up with this under here uh, where it wasn't oxidized is shiny you can even see that shining fella right there okay uh, well you see the hood here it uh, looks clean it's shiny and all but what I'm gonna do and some of you have asked me about this I'm gonna I got a, just a damp cloth I'm gonna wipe all the dust off it was covered in dew again this morning that happens a lot but we're gonna get all that off just the dust like so as far as I can reach and same thing over here get all the dust off because we're going to try that deal where they and look at this, this block here that other stuff ain't working very good let's see oh that's just dirt on it i guess it blocked back up okay anyway okay you can see that we've wiped it down that's all still have not washed this car we have not washed the truck now here's a clean fiber towel that other one was with warm water cleaning it right up here okay no oh boy short little son of a bitch sorry about that what the hell got looks like I got a bird on there hey bird go away okay shine right up by the way that bird thing came right off too okay all righty well, what we're going to do here, we're going to test this. Uh, hopefully you can see it. It's white, so you might not be able to. I don't think my fiber towel was very clean. But there she is, dried off. Okay. Can you see that? Let's see if you can see that. Yeah, you can see that. All right. Now, I've not tried this, so I don't know what's going to happen. But here's your water. What's going to happen is it's going to go all over me. But I'm going to pour it on and see how it sheets off. Okay, is it sheeting off? Yep. Yep, you can see it. It's sheeting. It's slowly going down this way. Yep, it's sheeting off. It ain't sheeting off as fast as it shows it on the uh, uh, videos because they're doing it on stuff that's round. You can see it sheeted off there real quickly. Well, it ran off is what it did. But it's doing it on the hood here too. It's still going down. It was up to here. I don't know if you can see it, so I'm going to point. It was all the way up to here, and now it's down to here, and it's still running off. You can see it running off right here with the naked eye. I don't know if you can with the camera, but it's running down in a stream, and it is coming off. There's still some spots here and there. Well, I might let that dry and see what happens. So uh, I want to get this off. Ugh. I'm gonna go ahead and dry this part off right here 
see this here beat it up. I don't know if you can see that in the video, can you? Uh, yeah, you can a little bit. This here beat it up because there's dirt under there. If you don't get the dirt off for, off of it, it ain't going to sheet. But you've seen in the other ones where the rains just popped up on top, and uh, when it dried, they were gone. There was no spots, so but wouldn't be any spots. But this is hard water too. It ain't like rain water. This is hard. I don't want to take that off because it's still running. Got a little stream coming down right like this. It's still sheeting off. Will it leave a spot? It might, because like I said, this is hard water here. Like, and nothing's on here, so I won't wipe that one off. But it's sheeted off. Okay, the only wet spot right now, looks like right through here, up here, like this. It's all running off. You can see it's still running off here. I don't know if you can or not. I don't know if it's got the hood in it. But it's still running off down through here running off down through there. And I bet once it dries, there's not gonna be any spots on it. I'll take a, I'll take a photograph of that. And uh, I'm gonna let it dry. We're gonna just leave it alone. See what it looks like, but remember, like I said, that's hard water. Mother, Mother Earth isn't gonna pour hard water on you from the clouds. Still, still going down, still going down. I think it's gonna go all off. Might have some spots left there. Well, let's, let's see what happens. Well, that hard water did leave residue, but it wipes right off. But it's streaked right there. Most of it ran off. You still got these droplets here that are gonna, they're gonna be kind of nasty too. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wipe it off. Uh, in other words, you don't want hard water on there. I don't think that protect it works going to work at all with that hard water. So we'll just wipe it right off again. That's with the damp towel. And we'll dry it off. Yep, just drop that one in the dirt. Not a good thing. Okay, so we'll dry it off again. Yeah, that didn't work. I mean, that works. I think the, their advertisement works pretty good because they're pouring it right here. If you pour it right here, it's just gonna run off, yeah. And you got a little section that's running off, but well, I'm telling you the truth. I'm impressed with it still. But if you pour hard water on your uh, rig, don't expect it to not leave a uh, residue or the marks. The hard water marks is what we were seeing. I don't think you could see them in that, uh, in the camera, because if it was a black one, you could see it. So if you got a white rig, man, you, you're good to go. Like I said, I think that's okay. I'm uh, I'm uh, let's see if I can see me. Let get that thing so it ain't looking in the sunlight. Well, uh, all in all, I like it. It's, it's doing a good job for me. I think it'd be excellent, like I've said many times on the motorcycle. Uh, I'm, I haven't washed this yet as far as taking it to a car wash. I'm going to take that uh, probably this week and get it clean because the wheels and stuff get nasty from driving in all the rain. But we've been in quite a few drain storms. Like I said, I've been we've been driving down the freeway with mud and freeway sediment from other cars coming up on us, and uh, that's the way it looks. Telling you the truth, like I said, and uh, yeah, hard water will leave spots. Uh, but the rainwater sure didn't. And, and this is hard, really hard water down here. So that's it for F11. If something else happens, I'll throw another uh, uh, video on here, but I don't know why I would. Looks like it's working. So you guys uh, check out my link behind, below and uh, order it through me, please. Uh, if the paint falls off or something terrible happens, I'll put another one on. If not, this is it for F11. Thank you, guys. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, and we'll uh, talk to you later. Cue music. <laughs>